Hello, Vettel121 here, welcome back, and we are Let's Playing Dragon Quest VIII. And in this episode, we're actually going to go somewhere. Uh, there's a lot of areas we can explore now. Uh, one place in particular I do want to go to that, uh, well, it's basically a town that we haven't had uh, access to at this point in the game. So yeah, what you want to do is you actually want to fly to the southeastern continent. And, uh, let's see, where the hell is this thing? Basically, you want to look for the mouth. Okay, so it's, like, directly south of us, basically. And, yeah, right around this area here is where I want to land. And, oh, look at that. There's something down there. Yeah, I want to actually... Shit. I want to actually land... Fuck. Yeah, sometimes it's a pain in the ass to get this thing to land where you want it to land. But yeah, I want to land actually somewhere right around here. Yeah, and you just hit the triangle button to uh, initiate it. And uh, yeah, let's explore. And whoa, 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 whoa. Where did you come from? Holy crap. And we have to fight a big blue belly. And I'm getting lag. Like crazy. Hold on a second. God damn it. Alright, let's try this again here. Yeah, I'm just gonna go with a little multi thrust, a little helm splitter. Uh actually, you know what? Yeah, I'm gonna equip the Shamsure of Light. I think I might be able to do more damage with that right now. And of course twin dragon lash. Ow, you bastard. Come on, just kill him. Yeah, there we go. Good stuff. Yeah, we can actually uh, run into a lot of new notorious monsters as well, but yeah, I don't want to, yeah, I don't want to recruit this guy. He doesn't look that bad, I just don't want to recruit him. But this is where you can find him if you do want to recruit him, so there you go. Alright, well anyways, uh, yeah, we can come over here and find a chest. I believe. And yes, it is a mini metal. Very nice. Okay, let's explore the rest of this area now. Yeah, I don't think there's anything to find just yet. And we have some Cyclops. Yay for Cyclops. I will kill you now. Well, they have a lot of HP, apparently. Wow. That wasn't very nice. That wasn't very nice at all. Yay, we beat him. I'm not missing any chests. I don't want to miss treasure. Missing treasure is bad. Alright, let's keep going straight, I guess. Should run into a bridge. Alright, we got some more new enemies. High rollers and killer croakers. 
and I'm getting massive lag again. What the fuck? Oh man, this crap has really pissed me off lately. Alright. Falcon Slash. No, actually, you know what? Go with a little Kaswoosh. And a little Kaboom. Oh, I guess Kaboom doesn't work on him. Eat it! Eat it, high rollers. Jeez. And my computer's being a real douche right now with this lag. Ooh, a cow. And we get some fresh milk. Yay! And at that end, so I guess we have to go this way. Go on the bridge. There you go. Looks like we have... And we have another notorious monster, and it's an arch arch demon. Hmm. Okay. That works. Uh, psych up, psych up. I'll just psych up one round and then I'll destroy this guy. That's not gonna help you. It's really not gonna help you. Alright, yeah, multi-thrust, helm splitter, falcon slash, and twin dragon lash. My go-to moves. Hell yeah. Ow. And multi thrust, helm splitter, falcon slash, twin dragon lash, oh yeah. And he's dead. Goodbye, arch arch demon. Gold monster coin, huh? Oh, okay. Wow, this guy actually looks pretty powerful. Yeah, who can I get rid of here? Oh wait, I guess I didn't need to get rid of anybody. Oh, my holy protection wore off. That's interesting. I didn't know the enemies around here were strong enough to warrant uh, holy protection not working. That's all right, though. Oh, it might—it might be because I haven't run into them before. That—that that could also be part of it. And okay. Okay. Just making sure I'm not missing any straggling treasures and all that good stuff. Yeah, okay. And Miss Hello, Miss Cow. Oh, you want to run away from me, huh? Is that how you're going to be? Really? It's bull crap. Let's see what our. Oh, wait, I can't do party talk right now. Well, let's check out this brand new town. Whoa. What the fuck? Okay, nobody has anything to say, I guess. Now, if I'm saying what the fuck and you don't know what I'm talking about, it's because of the lag. Wow, it's a monster living here? Uh, what? You! Human, are you? Uh, yeah. This is Try and Dummy. <laughs> Welcome. <Bye. laughs> oh, okay. Well, thanks. I guess. Uh, I, I think a monster just spoke to me. <laughs> He's sneaking up on Yangus again, Yang. Go blind. No. I'm fed up with saying that old blind. Oh, man. come on, Yangus. You gotta say it again. Uh, you there! Uh, you're a monster, uh, but you don't fight or run away? What 
business do you have being so welcoming? Explain yourself! Yeah, no kidding, that is kinda odd. Here in Triumph Gully, humans and elves and me! Monsters all live happily together! <laughs> really? So, why would I run away when I see a human? Yeah? <laughs> I... I... Well, I never! I had no idea such a place existed! Yeah. Of course! You know what this means? I can wander about without causing a stir! It's a veritable paradise! <laughs> well, what are we waiting for? Come on, follow me! Okay, then. Alright, well I guess we're going to be uh, controlling King Trode now, or something like that, or he's going to be in the lead. So that's kind of cool, I guess. And uh, we can get some really good items here. Well, we can buy some good weapons and armor that ex we can actually use to make better weapons and armor and equipment and all that good stuff. So yeah, it's definitely worth it to come here. I figured I'd come here now to get out of the way so I can make some good stuff. Some of the best stuff in the game. Oh, a Drackey saved you, huh? Yeah, I guess monsters are cool when they aren't trying to kill you. You know. Uh, sure, I guess. Oh, wow. Wow, the thing wanted to kiss us. It's kind of crazy. Yeah, he was kind of a douchebag for coming here trying to take over. Dry gig. I'm not going to try to pronounce that. This is a dry gigantini. Gigantini, Agitated, okay. Agitated, not distressed. Why don't you give it a try, sir? Ha 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 ha! You read me like a book, my good man. This is just what I was looking for. Oh, goodness! Well, well, well! I am impressed. This is delicious! Thank you, sir. You flatter me. Perhaps while you enjoy your drink, I could entertain you with a tale of triangle As you wish, my good man. This drink is more than enough entertainment for me. <laughs> you are too kind. But please, allow me to begin. <clears throat> it all started long ago, many hundreds of years past. The great sage Kupas was out walking one day when he found an elf and a gigant lying injured in the road. Hating to see any creature suffer, he tended to their wounds and he saved their lives. Amazed that a human should show them such kindness, they pledged their allegiance to Kupas. And from that day forth, the three of them were inseparable. But the lifespan of humans, elves, and monsters is very different. After many years, Kupas passed on into the great beyond. Determined to honor his dying wish, the elf and the gigant established a settlement here in the gully. And ever since then, humans, elves, and monsters have lived here side by side in peace, never forgetting Kupas's wish. Yeah, that's pretty cool. I like that, that. No one should ever be allowed to forget how Rapthorn had terrorized the world. So, that's why the inhabitants of this valley are always sure to tell travelers about the terror of the Lord of Darkness. Well, well. That's quite a tale. Very interesting, I'm sure. But this drink is absolutely fascinating. Yeah, don't drink too much there, uh, Trode. You don't want to get plastered. Well, that was delicious. 
It was worth venturing this far into the forest just for that alone. Thank you for your custom, sir. I wish you a pleasant journey. Okay then, I'll be right back. Alright, that's all for this episode of Let's Play Dragon Quest VIII. In the next episode, we will explore more of Trine Gully. And we will talk with our party members also. This is Vettel121. See you next time.